I'm Kyle Ellicott. I am the co-founder and chief labs officer of Wearable IoT World, uh, which is based in San Francisco and here in Hong Kong. Uh, we are a media and ventures company. Uh, so we have a media publication called ReadWrite. Uh, we do events and conferences all around the world. And we also have an accelerator uh, that we have here in Hong Kong, in San Francisco, and are just about to announce a much larger expansion across Asia as well. Thank you to Taylor, who flew out from San Francisco to be here. We have soft landing centers around the world, so here in Hong Kong and San Francisco, where entrepreneurs can go start their business, learn all about the IoT ecosystem, get deep ingrained, get connected, network, and also raise funds and do uh, some crowdfunding. Because it'll be the accelerator guys that make the money, and the entrepreneurs will be sitting there trying to go back to an accelerator at its end. And so what we're looking at doing is figuring out a way to change the model and work with everybody here in Hong Kong, all over the world, so that the startups have to do that. I spent a lot of money in the Valley on media, on events, and I, it's like valueless for me. It's valueless when I was a startup, it's valueless here. It's like, but there's value here. And so being able to create an environment and a system where my friends could build companies and be taken care of and have people care about them at events and the media, have people care about them when they build their companies globally. That was just, it was a passion project for me. Today we're really, really proud to announce that we are integrating with Fitbit, Garmin, and Apple Health same time, so we can check it out. We have a big media company that is teaching people all about this industry, and it's collecting large sets and networks in different communities all around the world, right? And we have a huge database, it's over six million people now, and we get in there and we create events and we create scenarios for curated serendipity, so that the startups get to the right people that they need, the right people that they need when they need them, and we have a 90% funding rate, 100% crowdfunding rate. Um, over the last three years. You know, entrepreneurs give everything up. They sacrifice everything mm -hmm. to build their dream and their passion, make it come to life. Right. And, you know, that means giving up a full-time job, making no money, uh, putting all your blood, sweat, and tears into making that happen. The no-asshole policy goes to, we want people that actually want to help and care. Um, if you don't want to help, don't want to care, that's fine, but we don't want you coming into the ecosystem and saying, hey, I'm here just to get the name and the title. Be there to give something back, not just to take. So biggest piece of advice I can give any entrepreneur at the end of the day um, is you're not in this alone. Oh, you are sweet. Don't 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 cry. It's gonna be okay. Uh, but no, very truthfully, you're not in this alone. Uh, you're not the first to build a company. You're not the first to have to sleep on your friend's couch because you don't have any willer to live or you've just moved to a new city. You know, you're not the first to have money and then lose it or have an investor and have them back out, have a product work and then it crashed. You're not the first to go through any of this stuff. And what you should be looking at is utilizing your network, your advisors, your friends, your family, and sharing with them because they've been through something before probably very similar to you.